245 years ago tomorrow, 56 brave patriots in Philadelphia proudly declared our independence and boldly proclaimed the eternal truth that we are all made equal by the almighty hand of our Creator. For eight long years of the American Revolution, tens of thousands of ordinary citizens fought, bled, and died in an epic struggle against the most powerful military on the face of the earth. They were the most powerful. They were farmers who bravely stood their ground at Lexington Green and Concord Bridge. They were soldiers who marched barefoot through ice and snow to seize a pivotal victory in Trenton. And they were selfless patriots who did it all so that we, the people, would forever rule our great country. Our movement is up against some of the most sinister forces and entrenched interests that anyone can imagine. But no matter how big or how powerful they may seem, you must never forget, this nation does not belong to them. This nation belongs to you. your history, it's your heritage, and our magnificent American liberty is your God-given right fought for. The citizens of the United States of America will not be dictated to and talked down to by corrupt politicians, tyrants, left-wing bullies, or socialist bureaucrats in Washington, D.C. I know many of them. I don't like them much. Our forefathers are the people who gave us the world's most majestic and enduring constitution. They are the men and women who crossed the Rockies in covered wagons and who faced unimaginable dangers to win the Wild West and who tamed the wilderness, forged the steel, laid the railroads, dug out the canal, raised up the skyscrapers and built America into the greatest nation in all of history, and we are not going to let it go. Our ancestors crushed, just absolutely crushed, fascism beneath the weight of American tanks. They toppled communism by the sheer strength of American culture. And now we will defeat woke radicalism by the sheer power of American pride. And it's happening. Americans settled the new world. We built the modern world. And from right here in Florida, we launched American astronauts to proudly salute our stars and stripes on that very beautiful moon. There is no mountain we cannot climb. There is no summit we cannot reach. There is no enemy we cannot match. There is no challenge we cannot be. There is nothing we cannot do. Because we are Americans and our hearts bleed red, white, and blue. We will not bend. We will not break. We will not yield. We will never give in, we will never give up, we will never back down, we will never, ever surrender. My fellow Americans, our movement is far from over. In fact, our fight has only just begun, you know that. We are one movement, one people, one family, and one glorious nation under God. So with love of America swelling in our hearts and the spirit of July 4th, 1776 stirring in our souls, I say these words to you tonight. We will make our elections free and safe again. We will make America powerful again.
We will make America safe again. And we will make America great again.